Hola amigos, what is up, this is Dance from Ranga, and welcome back to Let's Play Sonic the Hedgehog Genesis. In the last episode, we cleared up Labyrinth Zone, the hardest zone in the game, and in today's episode, we're kind of taking a breather through Starlight Zone, which is one of my personal favorites. It's got very nice music. Well, okay, the actual Starlight Zone has very nice music. This does not. Though this is still, by far, the least offensive piece of music in the game. And we've got a 1-up there, which is great, because, uh... Despite the fact that this zone is relatively pleasant, it's not a zone that I've practiced that much, so, uh... The unfortunate truth is... I'm gonna be sucking. I'm gonna be sucking pretty hard. There we go. Got up there and oop, Orbanaut right there. These are the Orbanauts that uh, are slightly different. These guys do not. Sh uh, okay, don't know what the point of that was about, but now I can't go that way apparently. Oh, weird. Oh, I'll have it your way, Sega. Smite me, almighty smiter. Anyway, that's enough uh, dated pop culture references for one episode. Yeah, probably not, actually. Because this is a 90s game, so I always have to say dumb things about my childhood. Or, well, the original Sonic the Hedgehog was a 90s game. This is a horrible port that they rushed out in 2006 because Sega really had nothing better to do. I like this zone, though. It's got a nice uh, urban feel to it. It has a nice pleasant city at night thing. I don't think anything's, you know, gonna go wrong here. Just because we're out on the streets doesn't mean that, uh, you know, everything's going to be all danger town and stuff. I mean, listen to this music. It, this is probably the least offensive piece of music in the game, but that really doesn't mean much considering it's still pretty badly ported. We go up here and trigger that which causes the bridge there to fall, and we can get these rings. And did the bridge continue? Nope, the bridge needs to fall again. That's alright, though. Because this zone's all pleasant. And the I don't know, that whole, like, city nighttime theme and stuff, I don't live in a city, so it's kind of, kind of interesting to me. Wait for Orby there to pass. Him and his spiky balls of death. And now we... Oops. Trigger some bad collision detection, apparently. What's what's the point of this gap? It, is it just to, you know, fuck people over? Is it the gap of fuck? Oh, I'm gonna have to roll into this thing, aren't I? Booyah! Of course, rolling would be easier if it weren't for the fact that the frame rate is... Kind of terrible. Kind of. Let's give a special stage another go. I, th I think it's been a while since we've done a special stage, so, uh... If we manage to beat this game with only five Chaos Emeralds... I'm gonna be kinda pissed. Actually, I won't really be that pissed. I'm probably going to be in a, uh situation where I don't quite care. Lots of rings in this one, though. It's quite pleasant. Pleasant Hill. From my understanding, Pleasant Hill isn't actually all that pleasant. So this maze is rotating pretty fast. Maybe it's because of the up and down things. Do you know how these are labeled up and down? Maybe that has something to do with it. I don't know, I've never really completely figured out the secret of the special stages, but... Oh, that looks like a place I need to go. No... No you don't, Sonic! No you don't! Shit Pickles, yes he does. Oh, Shit Pickles, speaking of dated pop culture references... Nope. Wow, this is rotating like Speed Racer. If Speed Racer, like, rotated, if that- if his job, instead of being, like, a fast racing guy, was to rotate, this would be Speed Racer. 
that's that's the joke, everyone. Good night. Thankfully, the red Chaos Emerald is right up in here, but... Unfortunately, I forgot uh, which... No! No! Shitty. That That's all I'm gonna say on the matter. So we are just gonna beat this with three Chaos Emeralds, aren't we? Unless by some miracle the last special stage is easy, but... I don't think so. Spring! Yay! That was completely pointless. Give me my rings back. Thank you. Why did why did I even do that? Let's take the spring again. Wee! Haha! <laughs> oh man. Such a happy-go-lucky atmosphere to this zone, though. It's a real shame that I can't kill the fella. Except I did. <laughs> Proves me wrong. I thought that the architecture for this zone was a bit more complete in the Genesis version, but... I... That's a vacuum fan. What? Then what's over here? What's it trying to prevent me from doing? Oh, trying to prevent me from getting near those bombs. Those bombs, by the way, are the only enemy in the game I believe you can't kill with a spin jump in any capacity. They are immune to your spin jump. I think you hit them, but... It... Okay, I didn't have to spin roll under them, I guess. You can hit them, but it... I think you go through them. I'm, I'm not quite sure on that, because this is the only game I recall the bombs appearing in. Besides uh, the Game Gear version, I could be wrong. I haven't played every Sonic game. Actually, uh, were they in Sonic CD? Because I kind of remember Sonic CD for some reason. Or at least some kind of variant in Sonic CD. I don't know, I don't play that much Sonic CD either. Anyway, these catapults right here, these seesaws. Can we, uh, get some height going here? Please. Whoa ho ho! Ho 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 there! Wee! Ha ha! Oh man, I find that oddly hilarious. But now I need rings. And now I need platforms. Now I need to get out of the way of that bomb, because it explodes. Rockets explode! Wow. In a dated pop culture references, that was Toy Story, wasn't it? Ah, oh, man. Well, at least we're now at 55 rings, so the end is near. We can go to a special stage. The last special stage. I do want to show off all the special stages, though. Maybe not fully completing every special stage. Wow, that was easy. That stage was really short. Wow. I guess we're gonna be do seeing all the special stages and maybe not completing them, but... Blimey, I get to do... two-thirds of the special stages blind. Cra whoa ho ho whoa ho 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 Oh, man. It started me out in the Chaos Emerald area? What? No! Son of a bitch. Son of a bi I knew it. I knew it was too good to be true. Man, that's interesting though. Do the special stages uh, repeat from then on? Or does it only repeat the uh, stages that you haven't beaten yet? I don't know! Kill Orby. There we go. If both versions of Orbanaut have, like, specific names, uh, remind me to not care. I'm just, I'm just gonna call them both Orbanauts. One of them is named Mr. Orby, though. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, gotta get up there. Thank you. Oop. There's another Orbanaut. Really, game? You do this to me? Oh well, whatever. 
Going up here, there's a fireball generator. And there was nothing to the right of the fireball generator. Let's follow the fire. Follow the tears. If you want to know where I've been hiding all these years... Great, I get to quote obscure songs that nobody knows. Okay, I, I actually... Maybe, maybe some of you know that song. If any of you, for whatever reason, find that song to be familiar, just, just say so. Okay. God, I hate how inconsistent those things are in this version. And now we're invincible, but stuck in the thing. Great! Good invincibility placement right there. Bomb. Yeah, you go through them. That's even better. Blimey, this looks familiar. Could it be that I've gone in a complete fucking circle? Okay, here we are at the seesaw of doom, death, and violence, and hate. It's gonna tie your own robe, man. Nope. That didn't do shit. That did. Yay! I have one ring to my name. One ring to rule some of them, hopefully. Alright. Jump over here. More. What? What? <laughs> um. Okay. 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 Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. Did anybody else bear witness to that? Cuz, uh, really, really hope I'm not the only one. I, I really hope that I didn't just hallucinate that entire thing. Ha, hallucinate. I, I really hope that that wasn't just a mirage or anything. I'm really... Okay. Okay, this may be my least favorite Sonic game. But sometimes, this game goes into the adorably bad territory. Also, here's an Eggman. Normally, you can't hit him while he's in the air. On, uh, the actual Genesis, the good version of this game. But, you can do it here. Hi. Hi, Eggman. Are you the Eggs Man? Thankfully, the collision detection on these... Actually, no. Well, they kind of get stuck in there. I thought they were supposed to, like, balance on the doobly-doos seesaw. But instead, they just kind of get stuck in there. At different angles. Different percentages. Whatever, what you're supposed to do is hit the bombs into Eggman, but, uh... You can just jump up and hit him in this version. And that's why Sonic Genesis is the best game- Oh, man. Oh, can, can I just take a breather here for a second? Fuck me sideways. Oh, man. Well, now that that zone's clear, I'm gonna see you guys in the next episode. This is Tales of Raga signing out. Thank you all for watching. God damn it. God damn it, Sega. Stop making me love you.